The recent Gibson Flats fire just outside Great Falls is something many people, especially the firefighters who responded, likely will not soon forget. The response included numerous agencies from both the city of Great Falls and Cascade County. Some of those firefighters who responded say the ability to work together was a major factor in the firefighting effort. What was going through my mind was getting to the fire safely at first. Uh, I was driving the water tender. I, I feel the same way every time we go on a fire uh, or significant medical incident that there's a human side of what we do. Um, we train hard for fires. We study hard for, for, for medical emergencies. Um, but there's always, so, so we're happy to, to do the job and we're proud to do the job, but there's always this human side of what we do that it is destructive. It's destructive to families and, and property um, and, and that people's lives are changing. So it's a little bit, um, we're ready to go to work, but, but we, we can't forget there's a human element to what we do as well. I think with the uh, evolving situation and all the different uh, entities that were working on the fire, I think the big picture went very smooth from my perspective and I think our engine company definitely accomplished our mission. I got the notification at 3 in the morning for a recall for a wild land. Um, so we rushed in, came in real quick. We didn't really know the extent of anything. So we went down the hill and I believe we ran into a member of the Belt Fire Department. He pretty much told us like this fire cannot cross the line. If the fire crosses the line, it's going to shoot through the rest of these houses up to the hospital. So that was our main priority, protect structures. Uh, we've had a few calls in the middle of the night and you never really know what to expect, but when we first drove over that hill and got to see the kind of entire horizon in flames, it was definitely a shock and we were just kind of mentally preparing ourselves for what we were going to have to accomplish. I was extremely glad that this was a career field I chose. Um, it made me proud to represent Mouse from Air Force Base and to uh, be able to be a part of the community. I, it was devastating, it was solemn, it, it was humbling just seeing just how much destruction there was because we were just on our structure and then when the light finally broke through and we started looking around it was it, the black was everywhere, there were houses that were down and just you, you wish you could have saved all of them. Now since the fire a lot of people have come together to help and support the people impacted by the fire. To find out how you can help check out this story on our website. In Great Falls, Colter Einstadt, MTN News.